There's no limit to what the Holy Spirit can do. And you're gonna see that in your life. When you're filled with the Holy Spirit, he's gonna do things that amaze you and he's gonna work through you. We read in Acts chapter 19, and this is incredible, but Paul would touch handkerchiefs and aprons, and then those same handkerchiefs and aprons would be brought over to people who were sick, and as they touched the handkerchief and aprons, they would be made well, and if some of them had demons, evil spirits, they would be driven out just by touching the handkerchief and the apron that Paul had touched. Now, the important part isn't the handkerchief or the apron. Yes, they could really manipulate that and, oh, we're selling handkerchiefs that the Apostle Paul touched. Come and receive this healing handkerchief. That was not a business that was set up. Uh, it was an overflow. And so you might be reminded of the woman who had the issue of healing and when she touched Jesus' garment, even just, it was the faith, not the garment, but that faith to reach out to Jesus. Well, people are receiving God's power. The instrument just happened to be a handkerchief or an apron. But when the Holy Spirit is working through you, there's going to be incredible things that might be difficult to describe, supernatural, revelation, ways that he's going to work through you in power. And uh, some people might be skeptical, but at the same time, you know what's happening and God's changing lives. And so the Holy Spirit will do what doesn't fit into the box. Don't be scared. Don't uh, stop trusting God or be more cautious. Continue to go all out for the Lord, knowing that the Spirit is working through you and the results, they're gonna be supernatural. That's what we read here in the Bible, same Holy Spirit today.